Hello, everyone, and welcome back to RNH Goes Live. Happy Wednesday. I'm Laura Osnes. Thank you so much for tuning in. I am so thrilled today. We are in for a treat because we are going to get to know another very lovely Laura. She made her Broadway debut in 2004 with the revival of Fiddler on the Roof before creating the role of Mary Poppins. Um, in the West End, and then also originated the role I saw her beautiful performance as Sylvia Llewellyn Davies in the gorgeous production of Finding Neverland. Please help me welcome Rogers and Hammerstein darling, Laura Michelle Kelly. Hi, Laura. Hi, Laura. And look at who's this. Nice to speak to you. Hi, cutie. <laughs> How is motherhood, Laura? Where are you right now? It's very unpredictable. My life is unpredictable anyway. I'm in Seattle and um, uh, really excited to be doing a song for you. Thank you. You're so excited to have you today. Hey. Oh, what a sweetie. Um, speaking of, you are going to be performing a brand new take of I Enjoy Being a Girl from Rogers and Hammerstein's Flower Drum Song. Um, first and foremost, I just want to talk about Rodgers and Hammerstein before we dive into the song. I got to see you play Anna in The King and I of the national tour of Rodgers and Hammerstein's The King and I. I saw you in San Francisco and you were effervescent. It was unbelievably gorgeous. Can you talk a little bit about your experience stepping into Anna's shoes? Yeah, I, I mean, I loved being on the road with The King and I. It was the Lincoln Center production <laughs> that went out to all around America. Sorry. It's okay. Um, it was uh, probably stamina is the thing that I really needed to learn on the road. It's such a difficult role to play, so complex, such a great character, independent, single mom, you know, based on a true character. I just loved it. I loved it. I think he wants you to sing. <laughs> so tell us about, you also just did a concert at Carnegie Hall with the New York Pops of Rodgers and Hammerstein songs. Tell us about that. That's right. I was very uh, honored to be able to sing a concert of Russian Hammerstein songs with Max von Essen, with your, our friend Steve, Stephen Reinke. Yes. Uh, and one of the songs that I had to sing was I Enjoy Being a Girl, which is why I chose to do it today. That's my baby, Raphael, chatting in the background, having fun. Um, and uh, so, yeah, that's why I chose this song. It's with my friend Maddie, who's an amazing musical director, who chose to put the track down for us. Uh, it's beautifully played, and so I had the pleasure of trying to uh, create this garden and sing this song and um, create the atmosphere for, um, uh, yeah, yeah, I enjoy being a girl. That's right. Yes. Well, here it is. I, I can't wait to hear it. I think all of our listeners can't wait to hear it too. So let's roll it.
that was so beautiful. I love your voice so much. You had just have such a gift. Your voice is so beautiful. I could listen to that all the time. Beautiful, beautiful Thank job. You. Um, I also just, before we wrap up, want to talk just a little bit about more about your Rogers and Hammerstein experience. Not only did you get to play Anna, but you also did a production of South Pacific at the Muni, right? Yeah, that's right. I actually originated, my first time I ever played Anna was at the Muni and it was an amazing experience. Um, and the next year we decided to do, uh, a, a, because it gets very hot there, there's 11,000 people in an outdoor theater, it gets 100 degrees. I had such a good time, I nearly passed out with heat exhaustion. Uh, so the next time we were like, what actually is an easier play to play? That means a bikini. And so we were like, let's play Nelly in the South of Pacific and everyone was on board. And that's when I got the chance to play with Ben Davis. He was my meal. And one of made, made all the roles that they wrote for women were really powerful, strong, um, opinionated and ahead of their time. I love Russian Hamster for that reason. Uh, and Enjoy Being a Girl is a very different type of song to what I'm used to singing. It's a lot of fun. It's a lot of um, uh, uplifting, but she's also a bit of a, a girl who loves attention. And uh, that's, you know, that's a, a nice, fun, comic, comic role to play. And uh, so, yeah, that's why I chose this song. And I'm glad people get to hear it and uh, get to play another role that uh, Roger and Hammerstein wrote for, for a woman, which is great. So special. Is there any other one you want to, like, check off your list? Before I've the never played Maria in The Sound of Music. I always played, as a child growing up in local theatre, I always played the, the different children. And as I got older, I played each, and I never got to play Liesl or Maria, which I think I also share that with you. Yes. Well, you played Maria in a, a, a Connie Youth concert, didn't you? I did, I did a concert. It was like a one night concert of The Sound of Music. and But I never got to play Liesl either. So I was like, she's the role, but got away. Um, I know, we'll never get to be Liesl. I know, it's too late now. Well, now you have a little one of your own. A little I know, he featured heavily in this interview. Yay. He's so <laughs> precious. Well, you're amazing. You are absolutely super yeah. wonderful. Thank you so much for doing this. Thank you, everybody, for yes. And for Raphael, thank you for making your internet debut, maybe. <laughs> he is loving the attention. So he's going to be a singer. Look, he's, he's enthralled. Look at, look at him now. There it is. Captain Von Trapp one day. I can see it. <laughs> <laughs> Lovely to see you all, guys. Enjoy the song. You and the, the and hopefully see you soon. We love you. We'll see you soon. Bye. Thank you guys so much for tuning in today. And Laura, again, thank you for sharing your gift with us. That was absolutely beautiful. If you guys are enjoying the RNH Goes Live series, I encourage you to make a donation to the Actors Fund. It's an organization that has been helping so many actors right now when they're out of work um, during this time of quarantine and dealing with COVID-19. So if you feel so led and you have the means, we would really appreciate it. Go to actorsfund.org slash RH goes live to learn more. And if you didn't know earlier this week, a uh, Tony winner Katrina Lenk's video of something good came out, her brand new RH goes pop track. If you haven't seen it, please go to the Rogers and Hammerstein YouTube channel and check it out. It is unbelievable and haunting. And the video is so cool. I've been watching it. Um, so check that out. And we look forward to seeing you next Wednesday. Have a good week, guys.